Hello everybody and welcome back to Space Gladiators Escaping Tartarus. It has been quite a while since we last played this game. This was actually a mainstay series on roguelike roulette for a little while. And this is a game that I, I absolutely love. I think it's a brilliant, brilliant roguelike. Very attuned to Hollow Knight-esque um, combat, but with some really cool like Slay the Spire, Choose Your Path style roguelike elements and some really good like weapon variety, item variety. You can pick up different armor. And it's just, it's just a very, very cool game. I've been really enjoying it for the time that I played it previously and it's now in version 1.0 as you can see in the top right corner there the game is fully released it's fully out and ready to go there has been many many changes to this game over the course of its early access period I believe it's something like 16 months it was an early access and there's been a whole host of changes and um, I hope that the suggestions that I gave and the help that I gave with the game initially has uh, driven this game to be as good as it can be um, uh, back quite a while ago now, probably uh, just a little over a year ago now, uh, the developer Blobfish came to me with some uh, questions about playing the game. I mean, obviously I'm an avid roguelike player, so I, uh, I gave some suggestions and a few things were changed and I think the game is in a very good place right now. So let's, uh, let's jump on in. We're going to play as just basic old gladiator to start and see what we get. So here we've got all of our stats, very, very, very many stats in this game, very many, I can English. Uh, a lot of stats, lots of different ones, we got health points, max HP, armor, strength, which is our swing damage, technology, which is our ability damage, uh, thorns, um, vampirism, spikes, metal scraping, uh, attack speed, speed, jump height, charisma, negotiation, theft, and piggy bank. Lots and lots of stuff here. So this would increase our damage, but it would lower. Um, it would it, it basically make our shop prices a lot, lot worse. Um, but do you know what? We'll take it. Why not? Um, if, I could, if only I can remember how to do anything. There you go. Uh, and then we can take the bow. And we can also take the recycler, which allows us to essentially take items and recycle them. But as you can see in the top right there, we've got... Um, our winding paths that tell us basically um, what what we've got if we go down different routes. You can kind of choose and, and, and forge your own path. One of the big parts about this game is destroying destructibles and getting money. So we're going to be destroying everything we can. And essentially, we, we want to take the path with the most rooms possible to try and get the best out of this. So I think we're going to go... Um, I think we're going to go down. And we're going to take all of these green rooms. So these green monster rooms are basically easy combat rooms. And then the question marks can be a whole host of things. They could even be a combat room. But I just love the combat in this game. It feels so fluid. The movement feels so nice. The animations are so good too. And one of the great things about this game... <coughs> one thing that... Um, oopsie, I'm sorry. I'm choking a little bit here. Oh my god. Um... One of the great things about this game that that got changed that I that I, that I hope was was somewhat influenced by my opinion was that uh, Blobfish actually took the the game and it initially uh, the way it worked was you'd play each area of the game as its own segment and there were their own runs. But I suggested that um, we it gets changed into kind of a more classic roguelike way where you just play through a full run. And that definitely, for me at least, really opened up the game a hell of a lot um, and made it so you can build some absolutely fantastic runs. Because one thing that this game definitely does right is synergies. This, this game has some fantastic synergistic items and i'm sure since i last played it there's probably a whole bunch more um synergistic items that work well together i'm gonna knock this away yeah there's probably a whole bunch more synergistic items that work really well together uh that i haven't seen yet because i haven't played in a good few updates here but we'll see i'm gonna try and get this chest here so normally the chests have like secret rooms that you can enter here we go we got it uh, and we got ourselves pretty so we get Extra uh, charisma and negotiation. So charisma, if we go and take a little look at that. Uh, items are 5% cheaper. Um, charisma. Oh, wait. We got minus 40 charisma, not negotiation. So you had 40% less coins for winning arenas. So our shops are still actually the same price. It's more that our um, arenas aren't going to give us as much. And arenas are essentially like your mini boss. They're not even really mini bosses. They're just kind of what, what you have at the end of every stage. It's a big, long room full of combat. Normally... Quite hard enemies, quite a lot of them, but you get an item as a reward. But you also get to choose what item you get as a reward, which I really like. So as you can see here, we can take portable piggy bank for 10 extra piggy bank, which is going to give us uh, 10 coins every time we clear a room. 
get a random outfit before any arena or boss, or we can go with enhanced gear, which is going to give us better abilities, better modifiers on our gear. I think this one's definitely the best. <clears throat> We can also take a look at what enemies you have to fight. This is definitely the worst bunch of enemies, and we do have to deal with some spikes alongside everything here. Um, some arenas do have spikes, as you can see. But this guy is going to be lobbing these little red turds at us, and they do cover the arena. Absolutely cover the arena. Okay, we're good. We're doing all right. Good, good, good. Handle these guys just fine. Try and use our arrows when possible as well. Okay, I think that's it. I think we got everything. Boom. There you go. First arena, of course. Very, very easy. There you go. Gear that has better modifiers. And we got some good stuff here. We got the Cyclops. Um, we'll fire uh, little energy balls at scale. We can take the drone, which is really good. And it gives us bonus metal scrapping, which uh, metal scrapping essentially, or scraping, I'd say, essentially makes it so that when you hit enemies, you can, after a certain amount of hits, you get some armor back. Really, really nice. I think what we'll probably do is we'll grab this um, and we'll also, this is also really good here. Uh, I think we'll also grab the crutch as well. Lowers our maximum HP, but now we have theft, which means you add five, five coins every time we kill an enemy. Should mean pretty big bonuses. Should be pretty good. And also this is, the drone is insanely good. The drone is insanely good. We just have to be very, very careful about our current, um, our current health. So, we'll, we'll go through the question mark route here and try and get some good stuff going on through that. I've just got to remember um, how to how to move around in this game. It's a, it's, it's a little bit of a tricky thing to learn, but the, like I said, the game does have great movement. So, it's pretty intuitive, but it's going to take a little bit of learning. Hey, we got some food back in. As you can see here, we now have a slot open for armor. And you'll see that slowly fill up. It'll slowly, like, colorize itself um, as, we, as we kill things. Good amount of money there. Uh, let's take a look at this path. We can actually go for an angel room if we go down one, so I'm probably going to do that. Nope. Oh, no. Oh, my God. That was bad. I pressed the wrong button to dodge then, so <laughs> I kind of messed it up. So let's go down. Hey, we got this guy. Um, hello, fellow gladiator. Need a little assistance. Minus one maximum HP, but we'll get 20 thorns, one vampirism. Uh, we're going to say no to that for now. I'm sorry, sir. I'm not going to help you. I ain't going to help you. It ain't my time. Okay, slightly harder room here. Let's pop this. But as you can see, the drone is insanely good. It does really, really good damage. Uh, we can take another crutch here, which would be risky, but we'd get a hell of a lot of money out of it. Um, or we can go with more vampirism. Nah. Let's take the other crutch. I'm going I'm to play it risky. 3 HP is not good, uh, but hey ho. 50% chance to drop, uh, to, to block trap damage is really good. I'm really scared here. By the way, I should be um, scrapping things. I've just realized that. So drone here is actually going to be super useful. We need to be not getting hit as much as possible to get our metal scraping going on. Good. There we go. We did it. We did it. Okay, that was good. Um, and let's have a little look, see what we get here. Another pretty. We don't really need that. Plus one maximum HP, but your HP is set to zero. Uh, set to one, sorry. Uh, we don't have any armor right now, so that's not great. A doll with plus three technology, plus one metal should be pretty good. Um, I think we go for that. Grab the doll. The doll's kind of like a passive item that we can hold, like a trinket. From uh, Binding of Isaac. Let's let's give it a reroll and see if we can get something a little better here. Um, oh, being this fast is really nice. Poop on your dash. Um, each poop deals one damage. Um, I'm going to reroll again. I really need something that's going to give us HP. Double the amount of coins found in Destructibles. That's absurdly good. Um, we, we are definitely risking it. And I could have taken Walter. Walter's really good here. But I actually think that... Getting double coins from Destructibles is going to be too good to pass up. Also, this is a nightmare room. Yep. This is a nightmare room for me. Oh, we almost died. This is risky as shit. I don't know where to go here. 
Lots of money there. I'm just hoping that that chance, that 50% chance comes in when we need it most. Oh, there we go. <laughs> the game, the game provided for us. Right, uh, let's have a little look, you see here. So alienized that we don't want that because that would switch out our drone and we kind of need our drone. Let's go for the jump height, why not? Um, and yeah, let's let's use our drone a little more here. So as you can see, some enemies are red and have that sort of red outline. That means that they deal contact damage, so we got to be really careful about them. It was actually a really nice change that that got added. I'm really happy to see that. I never used to do that before, and it just it, it helps with new players that don't know the enemies as well. You don't just go barreling into them. A lot of them are obvious. I can't believe I just got hit twice on that guy. So dumb. Let's just get you hit with that. That was such dumb damage. Um, we gotta take the risk. Ah, no, we're dead. I didn't realize that was a dead end. Either way, let's go for another new run. Uh, we'll, we'll keep playing as Gladiator. Gladiator has been doing as well so far. Uh, extra money in coin rooms, less money in um, normal rooms. Also here, we can turn on harder arenas, which is pretty cool. Um, I'm not going to put that on yet, but we can do that later. Uh, we'll go with... Yeah, let's go with Ninja. Why not? Uh, we'll take our laser gun and we'll take our coin shield. Protects from attacks, consumes all energy. Five points per energy point consumed. I don't really use shields all that often. And as you can see as well, my character is fully upgraded. You can level up. There's like meta upgrades to your characters. You can level them up as you play. Um, so they start with better stats. Like my guy starts with armor now. Slightly better HP, slightly better damage and all that. It's nice. Um, we want to be trying to use our shield as much as possible, really, because we have four energy. We're going to be going for trap rooms here because we get more money for them. So why not? Jump, 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 jump. And just remember to destroy all the destructibles you can. Uh, this guy's this this guy's a freaky boy. Um, exchange technology with max HP. Yep. <laughs> so now we only have five technology, but we have insane. We have 11 max HP. That was a great trade. Oopsie, I did not mean to move that fruit there. But yeah, more maximum HP we can find, the better right now, I think. There you go. Plus 20 coins. Very nice. We should use that a little more to just for building up our money. We're going to need it. Um, boom. But yeah, we want to kind of avoid monster rooms, actually, and just go for the uh, the trap rooms, because we we're going to get a lot more money for them. Um... One extra item at Angelic Altars. 3% chance of finding items in Destructibles. Yeah, we'll take that because it's early enough. We'll grab that. And let's go for it. Broom, broom, broom. Nice. Try and use our laser gun as much as possible here because it does pierce. Of course, we've only got five tech damage, so it's really not going to be killing very quick at all. But if we can use it, I will. Good. Ooh, broke my armor. That's okay, though. We got plenty of health. Here we go. And um, now we can start getting destructible uh, items from destructibles. Here we've got 10% attack speed, which is great. Little turtle here. Damn, this guy needs to be the turtle melon. Um, extra strength. Yeah, we'll take that and that, I think. We don't need tech right now. We're, we, we do have a tech item, but we're just... We're not relying on tech at all, so... Oh, my God. Oh, that was close. Oh, took some damage there, but again, it really doesn't matter for us right now. Um, we don't really need that shop. That, that little green alien on the map is a shop. I don't really care about that too much just because we um, we currently have a setup where we we don't really care about that because we've just not got the money for it, so it don't matter. We will go to this armory, though. We've got a deal with the devil over there, which is exactly what you think it is. HP for items. And we've got two armories. Um... I actually think we can, we can go to the deal with the devil because we can get both the armory and the deal with the devil for one there. Managed to block you for some money. Great stuff. Oh, you managed to get by me. I didn't realize. Oh, what we got here? There you go. Um, protection from all attacks consumes all energy but heals you for one. Yeah, that sounds way better. Sounds way better.
Boom. You hit me anyway, so you, you dastardly boy. Um, yep, keep going this way. What you got for us? Okay, some good stuff. Billy will give us food. Um, plus one strength for every mi minus five negotiation. Uh, that's not great. Plus three armor. I think we just take that for now. Come on, Billy. Let's go. Hey, it's Mr. Buff, man. Yes, let's take it. Hey, extra armor. Nice, nice. And then what you got for us? Essentially, we want whatever has the best stats on it. We're going to go for this because it has attack speed. Attack speed is really, really good. Especially if you get vampirism. Um, double the infective injections is great. We'll take that. Wait, can this thing be used at one energy? My god, this is going to be so powerful. This siphon shield is great. But yeah, I, I tend to not really use shields um, offensive, uh, defensively that often. I tend to mainly just use them for their, for their abilities. But yeah, we're going to be able to stay full health relatively easily here. No thank you, no poopy throws. There we go, I managed to use it defensively there. Good, good. Grab our dict, that's good. Damn, unfortunately we can't get Joey. Joey's really good. Um, also, the baby clothes are so fun. Oh, and poop as well. We got some real good stuff here. Um, yeah, we'll take that though. Why not? There's not got much money going on here. Um, lots of trap rooms. Let's 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 just kind of assess. Mm, I, I'm gonna go down for the angel deal. I think. So let's go. Fuck. I don't really care about getting hurt too much here. Oh my life. Um, yeah, we'll go down. Good. Good thing is as well, you can hit through walls in this game a little bit as well. Got you all. Boom, and there you go. Giving us some extra food. Nice one, dude. Nice one. Let's go this way because we get a bunch of trap rooms in, so we get a lot of extra money here. A coupon. It's great. I do love the, the design of the rooms in this game as well. Uh, since the there was an update that added like a ton of new rooms, and I, I really feel like that update just made the game a ton better. Adding loads of room variety and such. It was just really nice. Super cool to see. But yeah, trap rooms like this are just so well designed. I can't believe I didn't get hit there. Wow. Uh, and then we can take attack speed. I think we're going to go for attack speed. We're, we're, we're building up on attack speed. If we look, we're at 40%. We're attacking very fast right now. And there's a full heal anyways. Thanks, boy. Did not mean to do that. Let's destroy this thing real quick. But yeah, attack speed, in my opinion, is a lot more important in this game than uh, than damage itself. Because there's a lot of things like vampirism or metal scraping that actually proc off of attack speed. Because it's just based on hits. So attack speed is really, really strong. Right, you lot come over here. Oh, you did hit me. That's okay, though. I forgive you. I forgive you. Okay, this thing's still spawning, so I didn't even realize. Stop. Stop it. Get some help. There we go. Use our siphon shield to heal up. That, that's insane. Oh my god. 20% attack speed? Yes, please. Also, being able to take damage for, um, for HP here, for, uh, for, for damaging the other enemies, sorry, is going to be really strong. Nice. We're looking good on HP. 60% attack speed. Great stuff. 
Deal four damage to all enemies when you destroy destructible. That's really good. I think we go with that. And I think we do a reroll and see if we can get something good here. Uh, plus five metal scrapping. Minus one metal scrapping for every 100 coins that you have. I mean, why not? That seems fine to me. And then, yeah, let's go with that. Cool. Yo, what up, Lost Soul? First boss. First time seeing you in a while. But we've got attack speed on our side, so we don't have to worry. We can just spam through this dude. And the thing is as well, swinging destroys projectiles too, so even better. We don't actually need to heal at the moment, so let's not bother with that. Okay, now he's split. We still know which one the real one is though, so it just means there's gonna be extra attacks to dodge. Oh my god. He got me quite a few times there, but that's okay. We got the cross anyways. Maximum HP. And as well, we got the HP. That's not a thing that the, the boss drops every time. The boss does drop random stuff. We just got lucky. This is good. These guys explode. So let's be careful. Wow, this guy is tanky. So one thing I am noticing now is because we don't have high strength, our damage has fallen off a little bit. So we have to be a bit, a bit careful about that, I think. Oh, no, I think it's just because of the drum dude. The little drum dude there buffs everyone. Uh, let's go for the angel deal. Why not? Look at this. We are plowing through. Plowing through. Got you. Yeah, that was definitely the buffer guy making those guys so hard to kill. Um, extra damage against bosses. Yeah, let's go with that, I think. I'm hoping that we can spend our money soon to get some of our metal scraping back because now we're at 500. We're getting literally nothing. Yeah, I'm hoping we can up our strength pretty soon as well. Our strength isn't great. Want to go into these rooms? Extra destructibles means extra money. Also means extra chance for items. Thanks for throwing that on the spikes there, dude. Um, getting around the outfit before bosses. Pretty nice. We'll take that. One thing that we are, like, sort of losing at the minute is we don't have, um, we essentially don't have an ability. Because we, we don't, well, we've got one that scales off technology, and our technology is terrible. Yeah, don't worry about that. There you go. Got that. 25% um, damage with yellow abilities. Um, plus 6 maximum HP. Full health born arena can no longer recover HP in other ways. That sounds terrible. That sounds just awful. Plus 20 thorns. I'll take that. Walt is great for us here because we get double from everything. And I definitely should have taken the bag. I didn't realize. But Walter will help us out. We're getting double from injections. So... And we just spent all of our money too. So at least for a little while here, we're going to get some metal scraping. What up? Also, if we save these dudes, we get a bit extra. Got a mini boss down there. Um, I don't know if we're ready for a mini boss, you know. Let's let's go for it. Why not? The run might end, but heck it. Thank you for the money. <laughs> Damn you, you got me again. But well, there you go, we're getting tons of money here. Right, let's try out this mini-boss. I haven't fought this guy in a long time, so who knows how this will go. Oh, damn. Got him halfway. Ooh, there's, there's some lasers. God damn, when he hits the balls, they, they, they go hard. Okay, we're good. We, we had enough healing to get through that. That's good. Um, our dolly at the minute. We don't have a doll. Okay, so this is just extra maximum HP and extra jump and energy. Okay, we'll, we'll definitely take that. 
Extra maximum energy doesn't really matter to us though, because our shield takes all of our energy. Strike me. Back up to full HP. This truly is a very, very, very powerful shield. Oh no! Did I just miss did I just miss an injection in that previous room? I'm pretty sure I did. And there's no going back in this game either, so. Back to full health again. Yeah, there's no going back in this game either, so I can't I can't go back and get that money. That that injection, sorry. This guy's triggering this bloody uh this lever every time we walk near it. I'm sorry I killed that man. Didn't have to be this way. I just love the fact that we're like constantly at full HP at the moment, it's great. Hey! Um, minus one vampirism doesn't really matter because we don't have any vampirism. Um, Crimson damage in arenas sounds great. I'll take that. One armor again, five seconds of vulnerability when entering a room. I guess we'll take that, yeah. Not that it matters in these rooms, but in other rooms it's going to be pretty good. That's if we can manage to keep our armor alive, though. Damn it. Armor's gone. There's a lot of these guys. Holy hell. I'm trying to eat my shield up whenever I can. But it's, it's pretty difficult. Nice. Ow. Got you. Got you. This is so good. This shield. This shield has broken the game for me. Thank you. Um, no thanks. We need our attack speed. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. It scales with maximum HP, so we'll take that. Um... Technology isn't really that big for us right now, but we could take this. I'm going to roll for something better. Ah, damn it. Nothing. That would have been great. That cape would have been so good for us. Oh, well. Oh, I need that. Two maximum HP. Damn it, I don't care. Right, um... Head down this way, I think. Thank you. What? Oh, hot sauce. Let's do this. Give us a maximum HP back. Nice. There's that HP I needed. Got that going. Nice. Is that all of them? Nope. It is not. There we go. And we get extra strength and extra maximum HP. Seems good to me. Seems good to me. Um... Head back up this way. Right, grab that. Uh, yep, extra armor. I'm loving this getting items from Destructibles thing. It's so good for us right now. Um, keep going up. We don't want to head to that angel deal, I think. Extra tech. Nice. Shoot me. Give me that HP back. Thank you, thank you. Got some rocks. I'm fine, thank you. 
And then we can, the thing is as well, we can even use our iframes after being hit to get even further. It's great. Um, yep, yeah, definitely want to go for this. Nice. And there's our lovely little food. Thank you. We got ourselves tooth. Um, no. Let's just take the tooth. Why not? That extra damage could be pretty valuable. Nice double food. And we head up to our chest. Let's go. Got it. And what's our chest got for us? Destructibles, yes. Extra money. Pet master, your pets activate their abilities twice as often. I'm guessing these guys count as our pets. So let's uh, let's go for it. Give me that. This is a hard room. Essentially, I think we just stay in our little corner here and do what we can. Okay, this 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 isn't working too well. Oh my god. This is insane. This is absurd. There's just too much poop, people. I might die. God damn, that was tough. That was a lot of enemies. Thank you. Um, fire a laser every time you attack. Yes, please. I think we take that. Yeah. Um, pet seal 10% more damage. Go for one more reroll. Yep, why not? And then we got this. And there we go. Okay. We're looking okay now. Hey, sir. Wow. There's a lot of shit going on right now. We're just going to try and use our shield as much as possible to get as much... Um, as much back as we can. Try and get full health. While we take this guy on. It's gonna be tough, but we'll, we can do it. There's so many people. We're losing a lot of armor, but honestly, armor's not our real... I real get with us right now, so there you go. We got him. Vampirism's great. Okay, this is good. This is good. On to the next area, the jungle. This area is hard. This area is really hard. So let's be prepared. Okay. Grab that. Chest, please do something good. Yes, that's so good. I don't actually need to heal, so I don't know what I'm doing. I thought I needed to heal for some reason. Nice. You have to put it right there, guys. Come on now. Okay, good. Made it through there. Abilities stun targets um, once per enemy. 10% chance to block damage. Yeah, I guess we'll go for that. Wait. Yeah, I'll take that. 
Ow. So while we've got armor, we don't really need to use our shield at all unless we actually want to specifically for blocking the damage that's incoming. Hopefully metal scrapping will keep us going there. It seems like it is. Just keep going. This game gets real hectic as you can probably tell. As you can probably tell. Oh my god, so much max HP. Um, there you go. I actually just wanted that to get rid of our money so we can get extra metal scrapping. Okay. This is getting hit way too much for what? This isn't worth it. I've come up here for this chest and I've lost so much health just to get it. And it's not even worthwhile, really, is it? What's this giving us? No. I, I, I'd rather have the attack speed, honestly. And I missed my jump. What the? That thing hit me way late. I'm just beelining it to the boss right now. That, good. These mushrooms are really hard to kill. Bit of extra of this, bit of extra of that. Oh my god, I can't believe the shield prevents contact damage too. Probably shouldn't. Probably should only prevent projectile damage. Lots of food. Good, good. Yeah, if it only prevented projectile damage, it'd probably be, uh, be a bit more balanced. Because it project uh, prevents um, every bit of damage you can possibly take. It's kind of overpowered. My god, our maximum HP is just absurd right now. It's great. Right. We're, we're getting up there near to maximum HP now as well. Nice, got you. Uh, pets deal 50% more damage. Go for it, why not? Okay, things are about to get real hectic in here. I think we just swing like a madman forever. And hope for the best. Swing like a madman forever. That's the way. Oh, we got a challenge done. That's good. We got an unlock. Good. We're, we're at maximum HP now, so no need to shield. Until we lose that armor, at least. And which we just did. Good, good. Oh my god. More armor. Look at our health. Uh, ooh, there you go. We're definitely taking that. What money are we on? Not much. Um, nah, that's not good enough. We don't really want extra money. Just running through it all. This game, it's so hectic. I love it. Extra food. Got you too. I'm using our drone here just because it's so good. More of them. Good, good. Yeah, our health has gone like off screen now.
Oh, nice. Take 20% more attack speed. 80% attack speed. That's kind of crazy. That is kind of crazy. And then we just got our guys going, mm, every five seconds as well, because of that double abilities. Oh my god. I feel like a god. I feel like an absolute god. Strength's at 33 already, my god. Billy, give me you. Give me you as well. Extra piggy bank, why not? Let's go. Okay, as soon as we start getting hit real hard, we start spamming shield. For now, just spam drone. Okay, we've already lost two health. Spam shield. Got you. We've got this knockback as well from this, uh, this laser gun that we've got, which is great. My god, came out of that full health. Amazing. 25% uh, chance to poop 44 damage when you attack down. Wow, okay, I'll take that. Mushroom boy! Right, tank. It's tank time, guys. We are tanking. We can tank this. This guy is a tank as well. He can take damage. We have very, very high damage, and this guy is absolutely eating it. Okay, armor's broken. We took some damage there. Let's shield up. I just can't believe the shield blocks all forms of damage. It's crazy. Wow. Okay, so... Hitting an enemy with a basic attack without killing them deals one damage to all enemies, plus one damage for every... Uh, every time the effect activates. Wow, okay. That's really good. I don't know if it's going to be any good for this, because we've got the big boss now. 20% attack speed. Yes, please. Let's go. This guy's really tough. And he's very hard to tank through as well. Luckily, we have very consistent healing, so we should be okay. Like, I can just keep doing this and getting more and more healing. hitting me right now. I'm good. Come on. There we go. We got him. Wow. And hey, we got Alexa as our last item. What up, Alexa? Look at all this food. Yum, 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 yum. That was an insane run to win on. But yeah, either way, I hope you guys have enjoyed this new introduction to 1.0 of this amazing game. It's hectic. It's crazy. It's got some amazing synergies. As you saw there, we were getting stuff that was scaling off of our maximum HP, and then our HP was just going up and up and up, and I just love it. Yeah. Either way, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next one.